aren't you so impressed, your heart so touched by what we've already heard this morning, the, the talent and the excellence and the hard work? Thank you all. What I've thought of um, to say to you this morning has already been expressed, but I think it bears expressing again because it's just the way it is. So I've been a Providence grandmother for more than 60 years now. Two of my grandchildren have graduated, moved on to college, and Katrin is here as a senior this year. It's given me so much joy to see them as cute little kindergartners, <laughs> and then to see them progress from year to year, and now ser serious seniors and graduates. As far as I could tell, they loved their school every year and were eager to learn and do their best. So I'm a grandma. I don't know everything about this school, but I've made some ob observations over the years. It has been a privilege uh, to live so close, to be close enough to be able to attend so many occasions. I've been invited to classroom observations, to grandparents' breakfasts, to concerts and special assem assemblies like this one for Thanksgiving and Christmas, for graduations, and of course Shakespeare plays and then also volleyball and basketball games. In the early days, I could sometimes help out and pick the children up from school and drive them home. But they grew up and they could drive themselves and I lost my job. <laughs> <laughs> I have sensed a special atmosphere every time I come into this building. I know the spirit of God is here. It is a sense of calm and order and of love. What a blessing for our children. This is the Providence Classical Christian Academy. To me, the Christian part of your name is the most significant. It's of the greatest importance in this so turbulent world to know that our students are taught, that we believe in our powerful, eternal creator God, and that all knowledge and wisdom that is true comes from him. I'm so thankful that you teachers and administrators love God and that you model the life the Christian life for our students. Thank you for teaching them to know the truth and to recognize and reject the lies that are all about us in our, in our society today. A classical academy tells me that there is learning beyond an ordinary school curriculum. Latin and Greek and ancient history and literature teach our children to think deeper and to appreciate the roots of our faith and our history. And I appreciate that there are advanced classes and college level courses for students who want to get a head start on the next level of their education. I know this takes extra effort on the part of teachers. I know from experience that administrators and teachers face their share of challenges from day to day. So I want to thank you on behalf of all of us grandparents for your untiring faithful service. I ask God to bless you and give you the wisdom and energy and resources to carry out your work. I pray for his protection of this school and his wisdom in your planning. You are a blessing to so many families. We love you and pray for you. And let me just one more observation I have made. I see so many parents take part in the school activities on a volunteer basis. I think it's wonderful and probably indispensable to the school and to the students as they see and feel that their parents are truly part of their education. In Deuteronomy 6.4, Moses reminds the Israelites, you shall show the Lord, you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your might. And then you shall teach these words diligently to your children when you sit in your house, when you walk by the way, and when you lie down and when you rise. What a blessing that our grandchildren have a school and teachers who help make this a reality. And I just want to say one more thing. I was talking with Heidi, our graduate who is at Liberty University, and I, I said, uh, what do you think I should say that's special about this school? And she said without hesitation, well, they teach you to love God, what's more important? So there you have it from a graduate. 